If you're passing a home bargains, I thought these were a bit of a good find. There's nine apples in here for a pound value bag. They had red ones or they had these. While I was there, I got some, I can't believe it's not butter because that's still 125 and some, some shoe polish. That was 49p. But those, what a deal. Well, I haven't done this for a while. Not Tesco's actually, it's a Tesco's bag. I went to Sainsbury's, a bag full of shopping. How much did I spend? I went an hour later than normal. I'd only gone out, because um, it's such a lovely evening. I've gone out for a run in the car and I'd got those apples earlier on in the day. And I did want some fruit and vegetables, so I thought I'll just call into Sainsbury's. It was about an hour later than I normally go, it was about a half past eight, something like that. And I hadn't seen things reduced to tenpence for a long time. There was quite a few things reduced in the cabinets. And then when I went round the um, store looking on the um, general groceries to see if anything was reduced, I didn't really find anything. I thought I'm going to go back and have a look in the freezer, in the fresh cabinets again. And they'd put even more things out. I don't normally do this, but I did add up how much all this would have come to had I paid the proper price. And it's £18.90. And it cost me a pound. So I got some young spinach. 150 10 pence some chicory 150 down to 10 pence some sliced butternut squash 125 to 10 pence i got two of these mixed stir fry vegetables 155 down to 10 pence i'm going to do the chinese style sauce with these i shall cook it and then probably eat it cold one day. Because these, once, there, once these are all, like the red pepper, once it's sliced, it doesn't keep very long. So that we'll want using tomorrow. So I've got the Chinese style stir fry sauce, 115. I got two of those. I got the Be Good To Yourself Chicken Tikka Masala and Pilau Rice from 325 down to 10 pence. A lamb hot pot from three pound down to ten pence, and the living bacon with mash three pounds down to ten pence. I haven't seen things reduced like this for a long time, so I thought I'm going to take advantage of it. Clearly, I shall be eating what all this within the next couple of days. But for tempons, I don't mind having it for breakfast, dinner and tea. A pound. Such a lovely day. I'm going to go out. This is the next morning. I've cooked both of the stir fries with the Chinese sauces. This is one of them. Along with an apple to take with me as a packed lunch. I actually had the chicken korma for breakfast. I'm going to have to cook the squash before I go out because that's been cut as well. And once vegetables are cut, they are open to the elements so they need cooking. 
and the two meals, the other two meals I got, I've got a friend coming for tea, so one of us will have the hot pot and the other one will have the liver and bacon. If you're out and about, try and incorporate a couple of supermarkets on your way home. If you go out for the day, try and incorporate a couple of supermarkets on your way home. I went to, well I went north of Harrogate actually, but there's a big saver centre at Harrogate. Um, it's Saturday. And I think because it's the bank holiday weekend, they've got 25% off clothing. So I got this black t-shirt. Now this is from the men's department. I didn't like the ones in the women's department. I didn't think they were very nice quality, but this one is. So it's, it was five pound with 25% off. And they also got some pants. They were six pounds with 25% off and look at these organic meatballs down to 99p so if you're out for the day plan your route home in time for the reductions at about seven o'clock and see what you can get look what i found i was cooking down uh, a few of those meatballs four i think along with the sliced butternut squash i've got a little bit of that celeriac left so i used some of that celeriac a few of those organic carrots was it last week the week before and i was looking for some potato to add to it from the stored potatoes i've got in my hallway and underneath the potatoes i found three apples one of them i put in here but look at those those are from last october like I say, they do go a little bit wrinkly and they go a little bit, they feel a little bit greasy, but they don't go bad. So I peeled one and put one in the stew. So that will do me two or three days. I'll just let it cool down and pop it in the fridge. Just stretching everything that little bit further. I was really pleased with those apples.